Okay guys, now that my face is all clean, my teeth are brushed, I'm a little bit more awake. Um, I'm going to make myself a coffee. I'm also going to do some yoga outside. It literally, like, it looks so nice outside. It's been so hot, even though it's literally fall. Hello, but look how sunny it looks outside. The sun's just coming in right now. Yeah, I need a coffee first, so let's do that. Dang, my Wisconsin mug from my roommate slash best friend's mom when I visited Wisconsin. I have my coffee, lovely. I'm at here, very nice morning. Here's my dogs. I have my Spotify down below, by the way. I'm gonna play my Let's Sculpt. You leaned in closer, I should have kissed you. Your hair was longer, I pulled away from you. Moved to the city, over the Tappan's Bridge. You like the color, I can't see anything. Now I'm gonna go maybe take a shower. I'm so sweaty. Um, and yeah, I'll get ready and I'll come back to you guys. Okay guys, so this is the part of my fall break morning where I just wanna relax, light some candles, have some nice lemon water, and just prepare for my day. Maybe like do some journaling. To go along with that, I'm going to be using this, this new water drop filter dispenser. I'm so excited to show you guys what it is. It's literally so cool. So I'm gonna do a little unboxing. I literally, I have the whole box here. It's a huge box. Look at this bad boy. It's the reverse osmosis hot cold water dispenser to get it out of its packaging for you guys super quick this little guy the little cap that you can take off the carbon filter there I'm gonna lock that into place there's the little lock right there reverse osmosis filter it says it right there so super easy to know where everything goes. Okay, so I just filled up the water filter. This is where just all the water goes and they also have this waste sum. So once they like filter it out, all of the waste will go here, which just shows what good of a filter it is. I'm super excited to be using this filter because especially at college, like I need to stay hydrated. It's so important. And we literally, we don't have like a water filter. We've just been using water from our sink and it's probably really bad for us. It's probably why we get sick a lot. So yeah, the first thing I do every single morning, whether it's at school or at home, I have my hot lemon water and then I fill up my water bottle with some cold water for the day. Normally I have to pre-make ice cubes and put them in my freezer, but now I got this bad boy. The water can go as cold as 41 degrees, which is perfect. You don't even need ice. And it literally gives you your water in less than a minute. It also gives you super hot water within less than a minute as well, which is so nice. You can literally make hot chocolate, tea, lemon water, chai, literally anything you want. Definitely gonna take advantage of that and have that as I'm running out the door to go to class because I'm literally always in a rush going to class. So yeah, I am clearly at home on my fall break, but I'm going to be taking it back to college. It's also perfect because it has this off home mode, which normally when I'm on a break from college, I'm definitely gonna use that mode. Because when you're on a break, it'll get rid of any of the stagnant water and make it super fresh and ready to go when you get back from your break. It also has a six stage deep filtration, which just shows your water is getting it filtered so well. The six stage filtration literally makes it so I can put orange juice into the filter and it'll come out as pure water, which is crazy and just shows how good of a filter it is. And as a dual UV sterilizer, remove sediments and rusts and just all the particles that you don't want in your water so you know you're getting the best possible water. But yeah, it has so many cool things about it and I'm going to make my lemon water right now. 
Okay, so I'm just gonna go to the temperature and it went up to 203, but as you keep pushing it, it'll change the temperature to whatever you like. I'm gonna go with 185 because that's about the temperature that you want like hot water or tea to be at. And so I'm just going to there it is it literally made my hot water like super hot water in less than a second okay guys now i'm just going to drink my lemon water i really like having lemon water in the morning and at night i just feel like it really helps with my like digestion and gets me hydrated for the day i'm gonna light a candle because it's fall and I'm just gonna catch you guys up a little bit with my life. Literally, look at this pumpkin candle. It has a little pumpkin lid, so I love that. If you guys didn't know, I am currently a junior at Flint Lemon Asian University. I'm studying psychology. I'm halfway through the semester right now, and so I'm on my fall break. I just had midterms. It's like a rough start. The first three weeks were just like a lot from my classes and then a lot of like um after having like a four month summer jumping back into college can just be a lot just friendship wise it's always always in my head like oh i need to be going and doing something 24 7 or else like you're not gonna have friends the rest of the year like ah yeah but whatever is meant to happen will happen i don't need to like force anything force any friendships force myself to go to things that i don't want to go to now everything just feels like a lot more natural i've been with the friends that give me energy and that make me feel so good and i'm just i really love it like it feels like because i'm in an apartment this year instead of a dorm which might it's my first time being an apartment in an apartment and it's literally insane like it is just like the show friends so yeah i got my nails done recently <laughs> they are very fall i just thought you guys should know um and i really like them i also got a tattoo a long time ago <laughs> I got my mom's birthday and then I also got a cross but it's faded and I really want to get another tattoo I want to get one that says steadfast right here and then I also oh I just want so ugh, like it's it's literally addicting like once you get a tattoo literally so addicting like I want so many it's just let me know if these are like stupid ideas but I want to get 444 because four is my lucky number. And then I looked it up and 444 means, yeah, it's the angel number. It's an assurance that one is on the right path in life, which I literally was like just talking about. I always need to remember that I'm exactly where I need to be. It helps clear doubts and encourages perseverance with current approach or plan. And then steadfast is just, I don't know. I, I saw it. I saw the word after i got my first two tattoos which was like a few months ago but i feel like i've seen it like a good amount after but i saw it in a church service afterwards and i was like wait like that's like that's solid <laughs> like that would be a good tattoo because it's just like remembering that like god's love is steadfast it's never changing and it's always going to be there and so i feel like that's a good tattoo to get because it's always going to be there and just very dainty like insanely dainty i just love the look of like really dainty tattoos like they're so cute don't worry i'm not gonna get covered but i just want like a couple like really tiny ones like maybe like behind my arm like really tiny i don't know ah! and then for halloween sorry i'm just giving you like the fun little updates on tiktok this is probably gonna be so popular but i have my best friends we're like a trio and like i feel like it's hard to find a trio costume i feel like it's usually either a group costume or a duo costume we are going to be at kiss mary kill and i think it's gonna be really fun because we're gonna like switch up which one we are like, another update is i've been instructing yoga at my school i did this training program at core power over summer and i tried out once to work there it's a long story but i didn't end up getting a week later, I got an email from my school and they wanted me to work. They wanted me to be the yoga instructor. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, my camera literally just died, but I started working as a yoga instructor for my school um, and it's been so much fun. I've been teaching every Saturday. It literally helped me get like more involved in the community so much. Um, even though like I didn't get the job at Core Power, it's honestly been so nice to really just um, connect with people at my school. And but yeah, for the rest of my day, my dogs are freaking out. 
Hello. Uh, for the rest of my day, I have a haul that I need to film like right now. And so I think I'm gonna do that for like TikTok. And then I might go to Barnes and Noble. Ooh, and I wanna get a pumpkin cream cold brew. When do I wanna do that though? Hmm, we'll see. Okay guys, so I'm gonna film a haul right now. I am setting my phone up right there and I'm just gonna try on clothes. And yeah, this is one of the tops that I'm trying on for it. And then I also got some PR, so I posted that on my story. I posted that on my story. And yeah, I'm probably end up going to a coffee shop to get some schoolwork done because I do have a good amount to get done over this break. Uh, that is it for my morning. It's now, let's see what time it is. It is now 12 o'clock, so my morning has come to an end, but that was my fall break morning routine. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm definitely gonna do some college vlogs, so let me know what you guys wanna see, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time.